Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, cleaning up filament that Tim has left. Um, he 3D printed something while we were gone today. Um, so we were gonna go to Butler tomorrow, on Monday. Um, because the one place that we usually go, Sharp Shopper, they're not open on Sundays. But Tim came home last night, said he told his stepdad that, um, we were gonna go today. Because he just figured it'd be nice for me to get out of the house and away from everything for at least a few hours. Um, and he was right. It was much needed. Um, granted, we had Ella and she was a little brat at times, but all kids are. <laughs> um, but overall, it was a pretty good day. But this is what he 3D printed. It's a little dragon up on rocks. Um, so he 3D printed that. And then these pistachio crackers. Um, I am obsessed. Um, so if you guys know pistachios, they've got like the pre-crack in it. And you like pull it apart to get the nut. These you stick in there and squeeze. And they're like reverse tweezers. And it'll crack the shell open. Um, if we have pistachios, I will show you guys what they look like. But there's a two prong one. Maybe. Like this. Or there's the three. Like that. Um, I don't know which one works better. I haven't tried the three one yet. I've only tried this two one, but I'm excited. Um, and I'm going to get these listed up on Etsy here in the next couple of days because I know me, my hands hurt so bad while cracking pistachios, like my fingers, and they're even sore for the next couple of days if I eat enough, um, like right here where I like pull the shell apart. So this is going to be a game changer for me. Um, Tim uses his teeth and it absolutely drives me nuts. But yeah, I'm excited to give those a try. Um, anyways, while we were at Sharp Shopper, or at Sam's Club, sorry, I got Ella some more of the Carnation Breakfast Essentials, the Rich Milk Chocolate. I, I get a lot of crap for giving these to my two-year-old. But you guys, these... They've got like all of her vitamins and nutrients and minerals and stuff that she needs throughout the day. Um, like, it's just, I don't know. It, it helps, especially with her being a very picky eater to where she doesn't eat a whole lot. We grabbed some bread, some more mac and cheese craft cups. Some food saver storage bags, just because we saw them there and needed them eventually. Got some water. Um, in here, we got the butter. Um, we got some of the string cheese, and Tim got some of the Baby Bell cheese. Um, so you got those, and then we got a pack of shrimp and a pack of crab rangoon, I think, and that's it. Um, I think that's it anyways. We didn't get a whole lot, um, so we got, I think, ten things. One, two, three, four, seven, eight, nine... Uh, there's one other thing that I'm missing, but I can't think of what it is right now. But anyways, I need to go in and edit. Ella is in here watching Dave and Ava. We were just outside playing. Came in, got her all dried off because she was playing at her water table. Got her all dry. She's just laying here. You say hi? Say hi? Um, so... She's going to be sitting there relaxing. I'm going to come over here and edit and get videos up for you guys. And I'll see you in a bit. Is anyone else with me on this? 
you don't like to be the bad guy, but sometimes you gotta be when it comes to being a parent. Ella told me she wanted mac and cheese. Brought the mac and cheese back to me. No problem. I come out here. She helps. Ha! You eat. Helps make her mac and cheese. While it's in the microwave cooking, I tell her that we need to go in and change her diaper. So, give them here. You have some here. Then eat. I'm not playing this game today. You will go to bed early. We went in, changed her diaper. Not a fuss. I told her to go to the kitchen, get a chair. She needed to go in and eat or sit down and eat. She freaked out, ran back. I had to turn TV off. No more TV tonight. Um, no juice, strictly water for the rest of the night. Going to bed early. May not be a lot early, but it's gonna be